This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Principles. I'm on Unit 3, Intro to Programming, Lesson 7, APIs and Function Parameters, Part 8. Transparency, Red, Green, Blue, Alpha. Ooh, awesome. There is another command that lets you set the pin color called pin RGB. The first three parameters are for values in the range of 0 to 255 for red, green, blue, red, green, and blue channels. The fourth parameter, A, stands for alpha, which is going to be the uh, opacity. The alpha channel for color that lets you set the, oh yeah, the level of opacity as a decimal value between 0 and 1. So if it's between 0 and 1, that means like 0 0.5 is 50%, right? 0 0.2 is 20%, 1 would be 100 um, it is interpreted as, oh, here we go, yep, yep, so 50% opaque, for example, blah, 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 yes, do this, read the documentation, to figure out how to use pin RGB, go read the documentation, paying special attention to the syntax, which is fancy language for, um, the, like, technical code grammar, used to give the command multiple values, draw the circles, I assume they mean the commas, but, Draw the circles using pin RGB and dot to draw two overlapping circles as shown in the image. Okay. Okay. Now let's just go look at this. Hover over it. Let's see the documentation real quick. All right. Yep. And so this being italicized, I assume means it's optional. All right, and you separate them by commas as we thought. Awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and pick a color. Hmm, pinkish. So if it wants a pinkish color, remember R is first for well, red. And pink, I think, is going to have a lot of red. So let's try 255 for maximum value there. And then, mm, I'm not really sure. Let's say 130 maybe. And then I want 255 again for blue. Pink is going to, I believe, be a mixture of red and blue. And then... Uh, opacity. 0 0.5 we'll try. I'm not sure. Oh, we're not drawing anything yet. All right, now where is the dot? And let's do 100. It's probably too big. Okay. Thinking 50. And I'm thinking 3, maybe? Okay. And now we want this other shape. That looks all right, I think. So we want to change the color. And I'm thinking maybe something with, it's still pinkish, but it definitely has some blue in there. Who did I put? And let's do 0 0.5, and let's see what this draws. Oh, I just set the color again. Okay. Oop, I need to move forward. 100. Let's do that after that. If they're overlapping, I shouldn't move that far forward. Oh, 
All right. So you can see, I think I'm pretty close at this point. It is darker for them underneath. So maybe I want this to be darker. Maybe I only want the top to have any opacity, but you get the idea. I think that looks pretty good. Great, let's uh, keep going. 